Uh, today I wanted to do a video on um, some things that I had purchased this week and some boxes, sample boxes that I've got in the mail. So I'll start off with the Bath and Body Works. They were having a really good sale. I had a coupon for um, a free mini antibacterial hand gel. So I had, well, I had two coupons, so I got the, those two free. And then they had their antibacterial hand soaps, two fifty, and I had a coupon for 20% um, off. So I got that and vanilla buttercream. I don't know why I have never heard of this, but I smelled it and I bought two of those. I, it smells so good. And I bought a sugarberry shortcake. And um, then as we were leaving, I saw this cute little gem. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Little candle holder. And I have to buy the candle that come on it too. It's pink lemonade pound cake. Actually, I picked this one out. So, the freebies and coupons. I had four um, soaps, a candle, the candle holder for $21. So, I got the two, two little hand gels free. And then everything else was uh, additional 20% off. And then Ulta. I had a credit. So, um... I had like a $13 credit, so I got some poor refining toner, Neutrogena. Um, got this Sally Hansen's Salon Effects Nail Strips for $0.99. Cents. And I got some, oh, a general exfoliating pads for the, um, the Sonic, um, Sonic Wave cleaning brush thingy. Ugh you know, exfoliate your skin. I like it. It's cheap. I'm not going to pay $100 for a Clarisonic. And then in the mail, I got the Sample Society, Sample Society by Lore uh, BeautyBar.com box. That. I've, I've been getting these for about a year. It's $15.90 and then you get a, a a code for $15 off every month, which is then $50. And this is what I got. This is what my box looks like. Uh, two uh, Murad products, a uh, peel and a serum, and then um, Alterna volume spray. That's a good size for traveling. And a hair mask, and um, I can't an oil, um, so it, that was, it was a good month, I like this one, um, birch box, I'm so sad, <laughs> my little box, do you see this, little products, and this is a, a hair, little thing, half up, Please, uh, skin transformer face spotlight. It's really it's tiny. A little perfume. An OPI top coat. Breath mints. But the point system makes it okay. I guess Ugh, I'm just gonna move on. <laughs> Ipsy, here's the, ew. here's the Ipsy bag, cute little pink bag, the inside is really cute, animal print liner, got a, a Pop Beauty um, lip gloss, I think that it actually applies like a, a liquid uh, lipstick, haven't tried that yet, but I, um, I usually like um, their lip glosses, so I think I'll like that, and then I got the purple, um, it's a base eyelid primer shadow, and um, I think if you use it real light, it almost looks pink. So um, I think that it go good with my Naked Three palette. And then a Zoya polish. It's a really good polish. So like it's a full size. I got it in the pink. Let's see that. Woohoo! There you go. 
I really like that. And then, oh, I got um, false eyelashes. I, I use those every day. I lie. And then um, I'm giving those away to someone uh, that does um, bridal hair and makeup. So I have three sets that I um, received in various boxes. So um, I'm gonna give them give them to her. She's got she'll use she uses them every weekend. Then I got a skin step one step two blue clay activating gel. I always love um, skincare products, and I. It looks like you could probably maybe get two or three uses out of them because it's pretty full and I don't like piling on the mask, especially the first time I use it because you never know how your skin's going to react. And then you get, I think they're, um, if you go online, um, there's codes for each product and I think if you buy two Zoya's nail polishes, you get one free and... Um, a nail polish remover. I think you get that free also. And the Pop Beauty, I can't remember exactly what the, uh, but you, I think you get a discount, a 20% off. So, Ipsy is really good too. Um, I, I, you don't get as many points. Mm, I haven't, I have not gotten as many points through Ipsy as I have through Birchbox. With Birchbox, I was able to use my points and got a Mally uh, powder, which is Forty dollars, and I ended up um, after my discounts and codes and points, I paid two dollars for it. So that was a good deal. Um, but Birchbox, I mean, sorry, but Ipsy, I haven't gotten as many points, but I did not realize um, that you review the products and you get points. I had slacked off on that, and then I noticed that you, if you review it. That you will get points so that's why that's probably why i just haven't gotten as many points with ipsy but if if you want to sign up for it i'll um leave links down below for birch box go away go away go away go away um the sample society and ipsy Ipsy and Birchbox is ten dollars. Sample Society is fifteen ninety. With Sample Society, um, you really do get higher end products. Birchbox, high end and middle of the road. Different things that are probably you know I'm, I hate that I'm slamming Birchbox, but I, I usually enjoy it. But I just did not like this month at all, and I guess I was expecting a little more because they was supposed to. Uh, be with U.S. Uh, weekly this month. I'll, I'm just going to stop. I'm just going to stop. So anyway, something I've used up that I wanted to share. I, I really love this. The Tree Hut Shave Moisturizing Shower Wash, the Tropical Mango. I use this and the Body Scrub and I have repurchased so many of the Body Scrubs. I, I never liked Body Scrubs because they were too harsh for my skin. My skin's a little sensitive, but it's still dry. It's weird. Um, it's very, very dry, but it's still sensitive in body scrubs. Ugh, it hurt, hurt, hurt. I didn't like it at all. It gets the job done, but it's also, it works for my sensitive skin. And not just something random. I had a coupon for a free Think Bar, and I got the Brownie Crunch, and I, I had left the doctor's office, and I was starving, and I didn't have time to stop and eat. So I remembered I had this in my purse, and this was really, really good, and it held me over until um, till uh, dinner. I kind of skipped lunch, which I know I'm not supposed to do. But anyway, oh, one more thing. I got a MAC Zoom Lash Mascara Volume Instatune or something. I don't know. It was just a little sample of MAC. I think it would be okay. Let me see. Here it is. But it's so tiny. I'm having a problem with the applicator. It's... I don't have enough hands. It's kind of really small. But it... The mascara is good. I wish I could stick like a full size mascara down. Because I'm just like... I feel like I'm using Barbie's mascara. Anyway. It's a good mascara. And... I, I got these. I didn't like them. I gave them to Rick. He liked them. I can't stand any kind of stuff like this. 
Anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.